best music, man. 89.9. Yeah, man. Man. They're listening. Sarah. It's 24 minutes past 6 o'clock in the evening on uh, the 25th day of May 2010. The boys are out tonight on a titillating Tuesday. My name is Sam YG. My name is Slick Rick. And my name is Tony Tony. And together we are Boys Night Out. Radio personalities, more or less. Uh, we, it's more of a talk show rather than uh, a music program. Uh, even though we work for SHR, Top 40 Station, um, I think we've sort of changed the way uh, radio is. You know, people listen to AM for talk. Now they listen to our show for a good laugh, and it works well in the Philippines because there's so much traffic, uh, there's so much downtime in the car. It's not how many years we've been together. I think it's just the chemistry that. We all jive and get along because other guys have tried to do it or other other tandems or uh, trios have tried to do what we are doing and it just doesn't come out right. I think it's more of the chemistry. My dream radio guest would probably be Snoop Dogg. Why? Yes. Just because he smokes so much weed and, and I know he would have no holds barred. He's so smooth. He'd get high just looking at the guy. Yeah. It's probably Jay Leno. Jay Leno? Yeah. Wow. But locally, also would be Tito, Vic, and Joey. I mean, just to get those three with us three, that would be wow, phenomenal. Yeah, Tito, Vic, and Joey for local. Huh? Mm -hmm. That's what we'd like to that, that's accomplish. Our, yeah, that's Hopefully, our have a show, a noontime show. You know, let's just filled with like ladies. Oh, after a long time, finally, uh, some rainfall over the metro today. Yeah, I I got wet. Okay. And wow. so did a lot of people, a lot of ladies. Mm -hmm. um, like I said, mga uh, plants, mga flowers na hindi na diligan. Kanina nag water water. We do this thing called paint to abstain every year where we try to abstain from uh, any sexual pleasures. Of, uh, and one time, while we were on that paint to abstain thing, we had Tony, we had some Playboy bunnies come over the show. And I spiked a couple of because uh, it was uh, it was my birthday. Yeah, a couple of Viagra pills and yeah. Tony's. It was your birthday. This it time. is my birthday. This Nicely time. shredded, couple of Viagras and then into the drink. Cheers, bottoms up. Uh, Playboy buddies come in. <laughs> 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 I'm getting a headache. Sweat. Because I was like the day 29 yeah, or something. Day 20 of red as a tomato. No sex for 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 48 days for me, right? I was on this paint up stage. And I was like, oh my gosh, I'm not feeling well. Like, oh guys, I think I'm overheating. <laughs> like, overheat though. And after four hours. I got a fever the next day. After four hours, these guys go, at the end of the show, yo, Tony, we spot your drink with Viagra. And I'm like, oh, you son of a. It was his birthday. It was Sam's birthday. And his girlfriend had come onto the show. And I blindfolded him, right? And I told him, hey, I got you, I got you a bath dance. So I'm gonna blindfold you. <laughs> and this guy's like, oh my gosh, I felt something, what is that? <laughs> he put in peaks, and it was a dude. And he falls on the ground, the guy gets on top of it, and it sounds like shivering, he's shaking. He leaves, and man, he was traumatized. He had a fever the next day. <laughs> he's known for going to the malls a lot, slick, and so he was with his girlfriend. Oh my gosh. He was in Rockwell and he was going down the escalator with his girlfriend holding her hand, like this, right? So he's going down, and the girl that he was also checking was going up the escalator with her mom. Uh-oh. And this guy. <laughs> number one. And number two. Going, number two is coming and down. And as they're going down, as and he's going run. down. He can't, he can't run, because you guys are going to yeah. cross paths. As he's happens. going down, she's coming up. This guy lets go of his girl's hand and looks the other way. He's like, I don't see you. And she's coming up, and the girl's like, what the? What's going on? Oh man, I was like, no way. When I hit that part, I was like, oh crap. And I think on that note, we should uh, give Pagasa a call to oh. see if people should start carrying the, their umbrellas starting today and their jackets, or it's just uh, like a warning shot. The rain we experienced earlier on today. Is that what you usually give a warning shot? Well, we'll put the warning shot in there. <laughs> When you're when you're up, a lot of people will try to get that spot. So never never be content. It's 
actually sometimes it's actually maintaining the the top spot than getting there. Because when you when you wanna when you wanna get the top spot, you're hungry for it. So you do anything. You do anything just to get there.